it is 7 a.m. in the morning and we are in Al Ula and this is actually the second vlog that we're doing of our trip because we wanted to just kind of pull out all of the activity type stuff that we are doing extreme sport extreme do the other x make the x make the x how are you making oh extreme <laughs> sports yeah so we're planning on doing dune buggying which is where we're going now we just walk into our car and then we also have abseiling At so our last day. yeah so we've got lots going on but we thought we'd leave all the activity stuff to this vlog for you adrenaline junkies who don't want all the the Michelin star restaurant it's really stuff. Not that extreme, I no, guess. It's, it's, it's not. It'll no, be fun. But It'll it's like different. outdoor activity and stuff that you can do in a lot. And there's also other options in just these two. There's like a lot. We, we had a really hard time picking them. I know, um, I know. But we'll show you everything and more you need to know, where to book them, and all that kind of stuff. So I think we booked this, what was it, a few weeks ago. And I think it was like 350 reals each. This is exciting. It's a crossing, oh. a camel, the first camel crossing. Too cool, good timing, eh? We actually uh, organized that for, for the camera. Oh, so the buggies. The buggies were like 350 reals each. Um, and we got them through Experience Al Ula website. So we have Mohammed here, and funnily enough, so you are from originally Al Ula. Yes, I'm from originally Al Ula. And you've lived in the UK? I lived in the UK for five years. And how did you like it? Oh, it's good, but the weather? <laughs> First time, yes, I like it, but it's starting to become, especially in Brighton, because I live in Brighton, it starts to become like very windy, rain yes, yes, yes. every day, like in first year you say, oh, that's really good. You're probably like, we've got a, there's a beach in Brighton, yeah. I'm going to chill. I'm, I'm going to chill, but no, it's like cool. too much windy and cold, uh, rain, but it's, it's summer actually really good. Yes, yeah, yeah, yes, like for summer. like the two weeks of summer. <laughs> yeah, just two weeks maybe, that's, that, that's, that's the 12 months, it's all winter. Yeah, it's <laughs> like we only have here summer and two, two weeks Man, winter. Because it's hot at the moment, like in the day yeah. it's like 30, 35 degrees or something. It, sometimes it's 47, 45 Ooh. degrees. Yeah, especially at like in the, in the, the middle of Saudi or the north. But yeah. in the north actually cold in winter. So explain to people what Al Ola is like and how it's kind of changing over the years. Oh, it's like, how can I say it? Like, I used, we used to live like in a small town, very quiet. Like even somewhere, uh, like even the uh, cities that are near to Al Ola, like Tabuk or Medina. When I say I'm from Al Ola, they said, where is Al Ola? What's that? I say a small town, but now it's become internationally, like it's feel sometimes weird, but it's good in town. Yeah. Like we meet a lot of people like you guys meet a lot of good people from all around the world. It's make me like really happy. And then to there's see. like Michelin star restaurants. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it must be so yeah, safe. Like I, I remember we all have two restaurants, shawarma and Bukhari. kebab. Yeah, just that, <laughs> Bukhari. Just that. Now like Michelin restaurant, international restaurant, coffee shop restaurant, even like in the, do you know Al Harra? You went there? No, I don't think the so. The highest so, yeah. mountain here in Malala. Ah. Oh, thank right. you, Mohamed. Thank you so much. It's a romantic place. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> You're welcome, guys. Ijraat al al helmet. Okay, for the safety, for your safety, you have to wear a helmet. Yes. And, uh, seat and the seat belt. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. If you want to take a uh, video recording or picture, it's, it's fine, but keep your hands inside the vehicle. So it's maybe so it will be some extra or something like that. Hopefully not. Hopefully. <laughs> Inshallah. Inshallah. Don't worry, darling. He's a good driver. <laughs> um, and sorry, what's your name? Aziz. Aziz Peter. Okay. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. My name is Mohammed. Nice to Mohammed, meet you. Mohammed. Nice to meet you. Nice to
smoke. Man, that was so much fun. How did you find that? Oh, that was <laughs> about terrified. Of terrified, yeah, right? Yeah. You are wash. Wash. <laughs> 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 Thank you so much. Good that girl. was really good, good fun. And lovely meeting you. I honestly <laughs> thought I was gonna die. <laughs> Thank you. No, I had, at first, but then I had full confidence. Yes. yes. <laughs> like, even though it's not my first time, but it always, I always scare from this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Well, and then if you're yeah. flipping a car, it's yeah, self. I have bad experience. <laughs> now we're away from them. Oh my god, I was shitting myself at first. <laughs> I was like, sort of like, okay, so I just let go. Let go and you'll be fine. Cause like when you're when you're sort I mean, of like tensed up, you're not gonna enjoy it. Plus the fact that like the driver's just in a thobe. Like I was like, is this just okay? He's, okay. He's he's really good. He was amazing. He's been doing it since he was a kid. Incredible. And he says he's never flipped over once. But when we were going out and we were going, I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. <laughs> But that was so much fun. That was literally by far the best buggy experience yeah, I've had in, in Saudi ever, by far. Just the, the scenery. The dunes, yeah, they were really pretty. And, and they like, were so nice. Yeah, like, you know, when they like come up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but how strange, we met Mohammed, who had been in, uh, in Brighton for like four years with, uh, in London as well, and uh, life is amazing. Two, we met two lovely people and they're incredibly talented and kind of want to go again i wanted to go for another hour to be honest whatever all right on to the next activity our last morning and we have decided to do the thing that is life and death really <laughs> um what are we doing abseiling we're going abseiling which if you don't know is when you start at the top of a cliff and you abseil down and i'm spilling my coffee because i'm so excited let's hope that's not a premature Vision, a <laughs> foreshadowing of my well, your nose bleeds, my right? brains coming out on the floor after we fall. Last night we were talking about it, and Taya was like, "I just don't think they're gonna be very safe." <laughs> <laughs> and then that started getting my mind going. Really? And uh, I'm sorry. and then I was like, couldn't sleep because <laughs> I was like, who's gonna finish the video if if I were to die? Which one do you think we're abseiling down? Which rock face do you hope it is, Taya? That massive one up there. The flat one. Hello. Hello. Nice. Hello. Oh, you are cute. There you go. Now you're free. Now you're free. What do we call him? Milk at number two. Steven. Steven. Oh, he's so cute! Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah? Do this! Mm -hmm. I think so. Okay. I will follow you. <laughs> Team leader. team in the wrong way. I said. You did say. You were right. <laughs> Again. Ah, quite visually strong, isn't it? I'm gradually starting to get very nervous. How about you? <laughs> now the friction happening around these descender, call it descender, if you want to go this, this and down. Keep some distance in your feet, like a tripod, so you can balance. 
the rope goes behind you. You have to hold the rope behind, small of your back like this. Knees flexible. Don't keep your <coughs> feet bring like this. Feed the rope means you have to just feed the rope from your behind hand. It's called a breaking hand. And that, this is the right hand like this. Once you start releasing the rope, step down and lean back. Release the rope, lean back, step down. And can just we, keep it. Can we do a practice here? This is the practice session. Oh, thank God. <laughs> okay, this is the practice oh, session. Oh, thank God, okay. On the actual locations, we will provide two ropes. One this and one rope which controlled by us. We call a belay rope. So anything goes wrong, wrong we will control you. Your right feet and left feet. Okay. <laughs> so I've done my many courses mm. like healing, crystal healing, oh, wow. Amazing. aura reading, all this thing. <laughs> I get a very calming energy from you. <laughs> That's why he's an ab sailor. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> How are you feeling? Okay. Uh, like I did a practice run. Yeah, so. right? Thank God I asked. Step down, same time, same time, step down, same time, step down, same time, step down, back from down, yeah, very good, keep the left hand behind straight, that's it, excellent, lean back, lean back first, lean, lean back, lean back, you have to lean back, yeah, and feed the rope, right hand loose, right hand loose, very good, keep smiling on face, that's it, go to your left, your left, your left, mm -hmm. Fine. that's it, yes, you can do that, yes, First time, as if. Yeah, bro. She's lying, huh? Yeah. She's lying. Yeah, she's she, lying. She does that to me as well. Okay. From there only you have to operate that room. Left okay, hand. so I'm not doing anything with this yes. hand. Down, 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 left hand down. Always keep it there, here. Or if you want more control, just wrap around your body. <laughs> perfect, perfect, perfect. This is okay? Yeah, this is the thing. You're adjusting your... <coughs> Oh, no, I know, I know. <laughs> Good job, mashallah. Done. Well done. Woo. Woo. Lean back. Both feet together. Both feet together. Smiling. <laughs> She's doing such a bad smile. <coughs> Good one. How's she doing? She's good. She's good. Yeah, yeah. she's good. Yeah. Only sometimes she changes her face expression. It's okay. <laughs> Tommy, when I can't hear you. She's a going mm. over the edge. Ah! You got it. Lean back, lean back, lean back, lean back. Woo! Woo! How's that time? That's one. Pretty good. First little, uh, from there. Now we're going down here. Woo. Left more. Uh, you left more? Yeah. yeah. Excellent. See? Look at this. She's basically See? an instructor. It's pro. It's pro. <laughs> She's a pro. So I'm having a little breather here. <laughs> On that that area, yeah. So you will not able to touch your feet. Some of the places. Okay. So don't it's think so, don't it's think about that. Don't think about it. Just so go. control in your hand and keep releasing that rope, the yellow. <laughs> don't look down. So is it bad? <laughs> is it bad? No, 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 not at all. Just so, focus on. One foot at a time, I think. So, on that area, you need to lean back 90 degrees. Yeah? Yeah. You go now. Come on, guys. We don't go all day. <laughs> Love you. Love you too.
I'm so tired. Ah. Oh my gosh. Good one, good oh one. Oh my god. That's where we came from. All the way. All the way down. So those dreams about dying one. Uh, yeah, they were fine. One relevant while I. Made it. I jumped off. Did you, did you see that? And this girl was so slow. Weren't you? Tom Cruise thing. The mission. That's that's what you call it. Look at my hands. Mm -mm. Show him your hands. Oh, oh extreme. <laughs> extreme. What do you think? What do I think? I think I thought that was awesome. To be fair, like they were great at explaining shit because all the stuff that you were saying about safety and dying and all that kind of stuff. I was actually quite nervous, to be fair. But that was, um... They had a safety rope. Of course they did. Of course, <laughs> of course they, did. they did. Like, what was I thinking? Like, what are they gonna do? Like, put us down and then there's no plan B? Are you kidding me? Tay, you're so stupid. That was cool. But I think it was like 180 SAR um, mm -hmm. for, like, per person. Mm -hmm. And... Yeah, I mean, it was worth it. They've got some really cool stuff there as well, in terms of like, they've got like a big swing, they've got rock climbing, they've got, what is it, like a canyon walk. Yeah, um, and a hammock thing. A hammock thing. Mm -hmm. um, Lots and it, and of it looked too, busy yeah. as yeah, well. Yeah, so, yeah. Um, until next time, yeah. eh? Okay, this is the end of our activity. Little video. X. Extreme. Yes, um, and, what is in my eye? And we wanted to just share a little bit about what there is to do here. So there is obviously a lot of hiking, as you can probably see from the landscape. Um, at times of year, I think summer is a great time to avoid if you want to do any sort of activity-based stuff, whether it's hiking, abseiling, rock climbing, um, biking, there is all sorts of stuff, and I'm sure there's gonna be plenty more to come. I'll put the link in the bio, or the description, for the company, um, yeah. for the company and, and who we use to book, uh, but generally everything's really fairly priced and good value for money. I think the instructors we had were fantastic. Mm -hmm. um, they definitely put our minds at ease. But for us, what should they do? Like, share, subscribe. Mm. Like, share, subscribe. <laughs> God, it's okay. <laughs> like, share, subscribe. <laughs>